to cross the region have finished the 60th 10 tours challenge on Dartmoor today. The teams began to cross the finish line at just after eight o'clock this morning and Anna Var was there. 45 miles done and one of the first teams to cross the finish line. A lot of pain, but we gritted our teeth, got to the finish line. Uh, yeah, it went really well. Hot on the heels of the first girls team in. But there's no time to collapse. They're straight onto the medal podium before a much needed hug with dad. Today's the best feeling ever, but yesterday was not so good. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just happy to have finished. This may be the 60th 10 tours, but it's been a year of first, with this team trialling one of them. Well They're part of the Jubilee Plus Challenge, where youngsters with physical and educational needs have slept on the moors overnight. How do you feel that you're back? Glad, very glad. I didn't think I would make it this far, actually. And my friends also helped me quite a bit to get through it. I nearly gave up halfway through, but... I just kept on going. 399 teams set off, and despite the heat, only a handful didn't finish. They've come out of the pandemic. These youngsters have wonderful resilience, both mental and physical, and it's on display today. And we hope that coming down the avenue of people here today, they're making memories of a lifetime, which will then stand them in great stead as they go on to adult life. The pandemic pressed pause on this event for two years, but what a welcome back. Annaval, BBC Spotlight, Oakhampton Camp. Great stuff. Football fans will line the